Hello and welcome. Today we are looking at the class harvesters, part of the class DLC expansion pack for FS19. So I've got them out and we came down in the Alexian, which we got the Alexian there with associated header. And then we have the Tucano 580, same header for that one. Well, the header for the Tucano. And then we have the Dominator Maxi, which is part of the, if you pre-ordered or get the season's pass, you will get this one. So if you're thinking, well, how come I haven't got that one? That is the reason why. So we start off with the Dominator and the 108 SL Maxi. Now this is a nice looking mod, really is. Minus 40 on the slot count though, and will cost you 139,000 pounds, 7,089 pounds on your initial leasing costs. So it is 221 horsepowers and it's got a top speed of 15 mile an hour so you don't want to drive it too far and the grain tank it will hold 7800 litres so a pretty nice looking harvester so when you jump in that does fold up like that which I didn't really like that but it is what it is now we've got some flashing going on at Washoe See if we can get that to stop. No, it's going to carry on flashing. Anyhow, so going inside, and of course this one is old school analogs. So we've got just dials and good visibility inside though. You can see all 180 degree vision. Even see through the steps there. And then we got pedals. Yeah, the pedals do work as well. So lights, indicators, I don't think indicators, no, but the lights come up. Anyway, let's get out that flashing. So unfolding on it goes like that. That folds down and then the back just lowers. You see the back lowers down a little bit. Right, let's drop that header trader off there. Now the header traders, there's quite a few different ones specific for each one. They're all around minus 12 on the slot count, apart from the smaller ones. And you find they do actually lock into place. You put them on there and then they lock and then they lock again. This is where I didn't realise it when I first was using it. But basically if you drop that down and you see, you see it move again where it locks and then locks. Just like that so then it's locked on there and you push it and it won't come off which is uh, pretty good because these used to be a bit of a pain in the arse so this is the header for it and this one was the yeah the c510 and this is 5.1 meters wide minus 15 on the slot count a nice looking header so let's get it going now the header will cost you 26,500 pounds to buy and your initial leasing cost is 1,351 pounds so we can move the Heather up and down in and out as per normal. Which for those who don't know it doesn't make any difference on your yield. So let's fire it up. We'll turn the working speed down to about three should do I think. And we got a bit of dust action going on. But we can't really see too much on the harvester itself and we're straw swathing no we're not yes we are we want to drop that help window on enable straw swath
That was better. Bit of straw swath is needed. You see a bit more animation going on. And then going over to the, the header end. And it's probably easier to see inside. You're throwing that in. Nice bit of kit. I always do that, turn the engine off. I don't mean to. Right, lighting wise, we have got um, four stages where that's your first light, you've got your side lights on the back as well, and then your next ones, you've got your rear lights, and then your front lights as well, and then there's also this light on the side which is down to your pipe because when I first saw that pipe I thought wow that's pretty low but it extends outwards like that so not a huge size pipe on there but it does the job and after all it is, it is the bottom of the range one so it is your budget one a nice bit of kit right we will leave that to crack on and let's go and have a look at the Tucano 580 now the Tucano, there it is, just there. Lovely machine. The Tucano will cost you three three hundred and forty-eight thousand pounds, and the initial leasing costs are seventeen thousand seven hundred and forty-eight pounds. And it's got the three hundred and eighty-one horsepower, and this one will hold eleven thousand liters. So it's a fair old size. 24 mile an hour top speed on it and it's minus 35 on the slot count for it but highly detailed lovely bit of kit and then it comes with the header the 770 vario which that's the header for it there now this costs 49,000 pounds to buy i didn't check the forgot the leasing costs on that and let's go and put it to the test so first off you've got all the same lighting configurations the pipe coming out comes out straight like that and we've also got so we've got the light on there light on the back light on the front and then we've also got this one what comes on on the boom which uh, that's pretty cool I like that it won't let us unfold perhaps it won't let me unfold until I put the header on anyway let's get it down to the field and let's drop that header off might as well drop that off there and very easy to detach off these trailers look it comes off straight away does the double there it goes pops in comes straight off again I like the way that locks on, it's pretty cool. Unfold harvester, that's what wasn't coming up until I put the header on for some reason. Right, and we're set him off that way. So there we go, we've got the header going, and all looks lovely. And let's set it off. That's throwing out of there, that looks pretty cool. Let's catch up on the front end there. nice bit of kit just quite high on the slots that's the only thing all of this stuff is it's uh, pretty crazy really but it is what it is
Right, next one. So the dominator's got to the end there. And half full. So the Lexian. Wow, what an awesome bit of kit this is. Bit pricey, £489,500 to buy. £24,954 in your initial leasing slot. But you're not going to struggle on hills with this one. You've got 790 horsepower and will hold 18,000 litres, which makes it the biggest harvester in the FS19 fleet. 24 mile an hour top speed, minus 37 on the slot count. Now we've brought that header as well, which is, uh, I think it was nine meters, this one wasn't it? Oh, nine. This one was the, I'll get them mixed up here, the Convio 1230. Now this costs 83,500 pounds to buy, 4,258 pounds on your initial leasing costs, and it's 12.3 meters, which is why it's called the Convio 1230. Minus eight on the slot count, and it's a beast. It's not one of the biggest we've got, but it's the biggest one we've got for the class. So let's go and get it hooked up. The same thing again, you drop it off and it locks. Got those two stages of locks there. Which I like that. Then the unfold brings the stairs round, opens the top, the auger comes out. Somebody put a trailer in the mud, I don't know why they put it there for. But we've got the tracks, so we should go right over the top of it. So we drop that down, and then same again, we got lighting on the front and then on the back and then we have the front main lights and then you have that also light on the boom and the boom on the pipe out on this is uh, crazy it's huge and there's a light on that one so we start that one up and it is huge look at it awesome bit of kit works a treat we'll set that worker off working speed of six mile an hour you just drop that down to five you see the PTOs didn't notice that on the other ones the PTO was spinning away crack in now, I haven't tried using a load of these yet but I will do to get the uh, the sunflowers in I think I think we we'll go on to the Lexians and just do a full fleet we we'll do about four no point having any more you can't keep up with them not on one player anyway wow well, that was close that was pure guess I was a little bit left a nice bit of kit. It's the first time I've used these harvesters. Right, so we go on now, we'll leave that one running, and then we can go on and have a look at the corn headers. So we've got the corn header set up and the folding action on this. Well, not that action, that action. I like that. And then they all fold into place, ready for work. And then unfold on the harvester. nice size header and the advantage is you don't need a, a trailer 
just fold it up and off you go so we've got sunflowers which these headers do do sunflowers and corn turn the working speed down and away we go well, there's a little bit of a glitch in there I think we lost a couple of frames nice it's just a shame the 12 meter one doesn't fold and let's go and check out the larger one then So we've got the Corio, this is the 1275C. And it's got the same old unfold feature, just a lot bigger. So this header will cost you. £79,000 which is uh, quite a lot but it is a big old header 9 metres wide and it's only going to cost you £4,059 on £54 for your initial leasing costs which is quite cheap you just need a header trailer and I don't tend to use them I tend to use the folded out ones just makes things easier you don't have to mess around with a header trailer and that is working a peach proper job now inside on these as well you've got all the screens on there they look pretty cool oh I didn't notice you you can see in the back as well that's cool I like that and we have got animation going on but we just can't see it it's a little bit here and there nice looking bit of kit though it really is proper job Cool. Right out, well that's your lot for class DLC harvesters. Um, I'm gonna put them into action very shortly. We're gonna get all this sunflower done with a load of lexins. And I might even use the Helianthus header to get that seven mile an hour working instead of six. But we shall see. Right out, well if you've enjoyed this episode, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new to the channel, go and take a look at my hundreds of other Farming Simulator 19 videos. I've got over 500 available now, so they, I guarantee there'll be quite a few you'll be interested in. So thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.